Lawmaker representing Ideato North uh, local government or constituency in the House of Representatives, uh, Ugo Chinere Ikeagono, has called on ECOWAS to go beyond sanctions in its bid to restore the democratically elected government in Niger Republic. A National Assembly correspondent, Jokia Disa, reports. Military incursions and governance are no longer fashionable. Niger Republic is now in the eye of the storm after the fifth military coup since independence. The head of the country's presidential guard led the coup against democratically elected president, citing grievances over insecurity and poverty. Since then, the Economic Community of West African States, ECOWAS, has taken prompt actions to register its dissatisfaction. A number of sanctions have been spelled out and a series of meetings of heads of state under the leadership of President Bola Tinumbu held. This Imo State legislator is now adding his voice to the clam of adherence to the adopted ECOWAS Protocol of 2011, which stipulates that the only path to power is through the ballot. He commends the President Tinubu led ECOWAS for the actions taken thus far. So I'm commending the ECOWAS uh, uh, head of states uh, led by President uh, Bola Meto for the series of meetings they have had in the last few days towards finding uh, uh, the easy path to restoring democracy in Niger. But that we are demanding that the right thing to do is to deploy military action. And when we had problem in Guinea-Bissau, when the queue, the attempted queue failed, ECOWAS moved beyond sanction and deployed a strong contingent force. But he calls on the sub-regional group to deploy a strong contingent force, which put paid to the recent coup attempt in Guinea-Bissau. That if we don't fix what is happening by the side of our neighbor, it will also inflame and worsen the security problems we're already having in Nigeria. So what I'm proposing is that in order to teach you know, renegade presidential guards and power-hungry elements like General uh, Abrahman Tichani, a lesson, is that President uh, uh, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, in consultation with other heads of authority in West Africa, should assemble the stabilization force, the, the contingency force, by our the chief of defense, uh, uh, the chief of defense uh, forces in West Africa, to immediately move into Niger to, to stop what is currently going on. The lawmaker also speaks on the recent arrest of a journalist in Imo State. I'm using this opportunity to call on the DSS and the police and Mr. President to please intervene on the arrest of uh, Nosongwa and ensure that he's released. If you say he has committed an offense, the right thing to do is to charge him to court. You do not have, and I repeat, you do not have any reason to hold Nosongwa more than the stipulated constitutional provision. The legislature believes very strongly that decisive military action against the Niger military junta will assist greatly in averting a likely resurgence of insecurity in Nigeria and neighboring countries. Jokia Edson, TBC News, Abuja.